Well, it's a challenge, but it's, I mean, it's really an exercise in nostalgia because I, like so many people, grew up with Oktoberfest being, you know, the big event in the fall in Martinsville. And I remember it very fondly and coming up town and, and there was the guy that made little hand-carved wooden toys. Oh, I loved going to see what he had every year. So it was, it was something that, that I remembered fondly that I really wanted to see flourish again. Um, and it had been being run by a group of volunteers, you know, seven, eight volunteers that were just doing it in their spare time. And I got to tell you, it's for months on end, this is a full-time job trying to pull this deal together. So we were lucky to have some folks that, that kept it from falling apart entirely. But it, my assistant Liz and I spend months getting ready for this. Yes, dress comfortably and wear comfortable walking shoes because we have... 215 vendors as of the latest count and we've got you know three city blocks down and three city blocks back for you to walk and lots to see and if you're feeling in the mood you can even try some German dancing so definitely wear comfortable shoes um, I think what a lot of people have been asking about is parking since we're gonna have Church Street and Main Street and this crossover here at Leicester closed down um, you're gonna want to try coming along either Market Street um, and coming up Broad or Bridge or Moss Street, you know, park in the city lots or one of the bank lots down here, or even as, you know, some of the smaller business, you know, Scott and Stringfellow has parking down here and the middle school has parking on Cleveland Avenue and just some of the, you know, the business places. Or if you come up the other way from Commonwealth, you can park along um, Depot Street and there's the new Depot Street parking lot that, that they've put in where there's a lot of places to park. And we've gone out of our way to try and invite folks from other areas. I've done a lot of marketing both inside Martinsville, Henry County, but in Danville, Pennsylvania County, Chatham, Madison, Eden, um, throughout Rockingham County, Franklin County, Patrick County, um, because I want people to come in and see what Martinsville has to offer. We've got some great new businesses uptown and I'm really pleased to say that last year several of our uptown businesses said that Oktoberfest was their best sales day of the year. So we get a lot of new people to come in and see that we've got some great shopping opportunities in uptown. Um, last year we had people that were starting to walk up through the streets at about quarter to 11. Because if you really want to walk around and see everything, you need to be here at 11 o'clock. Because there's a lot to see, there's a lot to do, there's kids things, there's a haunted house, there's inflatables, there's a petting zoo, there's bands, there's um, steel drums, there's the German folks, there's German dancing and food if you want to try that. Down in the food court we've got our beer garden if you want to sample some of the craft beers we've got. Uh, we've even got a martial arts demonstration that's going to happen in the middle of Leicester Street. So. We've got events, you know, things start kicking off at 11 o'clock and they don't end until 4, so.